Sunday friends. I always look like I'm glowing with this desk lamp. It's kind of fun. I am just jumping in for the last tip of our holiday tip series that I've been doing on my Facebook page uh, to kind of prepare you all for the summit that's starting tomorrow, the Healthy Holiday Summit, and which will be about with tons of tips from 17 different health and wellness professionals, all women, talking about holiday, being healthy in the holidays um, in areas of, such as nutrition, exercise, stress, sleep, digestion, toxic load, um, mindset and habits. And my co-host, with co-host Anya Perry, and I are just super excited because we've got to preview all of these and all of the resources and giveaways that are going to happen too. So I just wanted to end off my little tip series saying, have some healthy holiday fun. And what I mean by that is there are so many ways that even if you wanted to approach this holiday season where like, I want to enjoy my typical foods or my typical things and all these different things, there are ways to kind of make it healthier, such as if you want to make pumpkin pie, if you want your regular pumpkin pie, you can do that. If you want to do a try a different healthier recipe, you can do that too. There's no, there's no like yes or right or wrong answer here, right? And I just think if you just really create one, take on one of these tips that either I've been saying or that the ladies will say in this upcoming week from each of these different areas, you will have a healthier and happier holiday season, which I, that's what I want. I want to have a happy holiday season, but I want to like take care of my health. And so that when January comes around, I am not going to be making goals out of a place of guilt or shame or just wanting to fix what maybe happened. Uh, I want to be able to make goals because that's the next best thing for me, right? And so there's so many ways that you can have fun and it be healthy, such as, you know, exercise, you'll get all kind of tips. You know, it maybe over the holidays, it does not have to be the typical standard types that you do maybe you're like you know what um we're camping so let's just go for a hike like that's my exercise today or the kids are playing outside let's go play together uh you know with sleep you know let's make it a contest who can sleep the most i don't know whatever it may be like just see how you can have fun this holiday season and make it a healthy alternative as well right one way i'm gonna do that is let me think about this I think sleep is a priority for my life right now. Um, but I just think for me, having fun would just be to enjoy uh, to enjoy the foods that I typically eat. Uh, but also, if I can make a healthier version, that would just make me feel better. It's fun. Like, creating things like that is fun. I've been doing all kinds of stuff with essential oils. Talking about toxic load. This holiday season is probably one of the first holiday seasons, or the second, that I will be using a lot of essential oils to make the place smell like Christmas. And that's healthier. It helps me helps everyone else that gets to be around it. Um, and then, you know, just trying different recipes. I love doing that as well. And it's just don't typically have the, the time for that. So making that a priority of just having fun while I kind of recreate some some healthy thing, alternatives, right? So that's me. So, uh, but you know, you, ladies, there's so many tips that you can get from this summit. So go to madewell345.com slash healthy holiday summit. And you're going to get five tips tomorrow because tomorrow's um, Mindset and Habits, I'll be sharing a tip, Annie will be sharing a tip, and three other um, health and wellness professionals. And then each week, uh, each day, sorry, till Friday, there'll be either, I think, three to five ladies who will share different tips. Probably less than that, because it's only 19. And then you'll have the weekend to watch them all again, so, you know, in case you fall behind, but the tips are short. They're like five, six, seven minutes. Uh, and then you can win some prizes if you join me in Anya's group, the Healthy Body Community and Eat Well and Thrive with Anya Perry. You can comment on the prizes you want to win and also get free downloads and free resources. So it's just going to be awesome. And then um, Anya and I are going to both share about opportunities to just continue to support you uh, from basically the period of after Thanksgiving to the beginning of the year. I'll be sharing more about my Healthy Body Academy, which is actually one of the prizes you can win a free month in that which launches on Black Friday. Super excited about that. It's going to be a membership community for women where it that's how I will be coaching women going forward because more many of you know I'm transitioning to um, working full-time in a not-for-profit. So I'm excited. All right, I'm going to go back to resting. Today's my rest day. Uh, but I just wanted to jump in and say hello and welcome, uh, invite you to the summit happening tomorrow. So thank you for all who watched. If you're on live or if you're watching the replay, say hello. Let me know how you are. Hopefully this tip impacted you in some way. 
and please sign up for the summit. It's a free summit, so uh, it's really for ladies, but if you're a man, you can sign up too. Of course, you need those tips too, right? So I'll talk to you later, and hopefully see you tomorrow in the summit.